Hello everyone, I'm the Solar Gamer, and welcome back to Europa Universalis 4 as Scandinavia. Welcome to Fall. Oh my god, I, I just clicked on um, the region map mode when I came in here, and look at how beautiful this looks. It's all very orange, and uh, I, don't, I really like this a lot. Uh, there's some snow patches over here, which is actually kind of cool, but it, uh, just, I love this. I love this, this the nice brown orangey trees. I'm trying to look at uh, Massachusetts. Or New England in general, but it's not as colorful as I would imagine. Which is a shame, because it should be. It should be reds and yellows and oranges, but that's alright. Whatever. It's fine. Okay, so let's jump right back into it. Now, I do... Mm, the problem with the new expansion that just came out is that I'm colonizing, right? And I don't know if I get the abilities of what the expansion offers. Now, what's funny is I actually played a save game from before the expansion pack, and then afterwards, uh, it seemed like it did change some things with colonization, so I think that we're still gonna get some of the, the features of the expansion packs, like the, um, the colony management. As you can see right here, my subjects. I mean, this is a nice little tab anyways, it shows all my vassals, but what it's gonna do is, I think if I have enough provinces over here, it'll start showing me, um, New Finland, or Quebec, or whatever it is. Um, we'll have to see what that does, but I think I actually will be able to get some of the features that the uh, the new expansion offers, which is fantastic. So we don't have to restart or start a new game for it to take effect. I mean, some of the things, yes, like all of the Native American tribes that were added, those are not here, um, but that shouldn't be much of an issue, I don't think. Yeah, considering we are taking North America, it does suck that we don't have them there to provide... Um, I don't know, just a new experience, but that's alright. That's for another time. Alrighty, so let's get back into it. So we just ended our Peasants' War, which is freaking fantastic, because that was the one thing that was holding us back. Um, oh, Portugal is disputed secession. Why, what's up? Uh, region, no, it's a re oh, it must be a weak claim. I don't want to press anything yet, because I don't want to ruin my royal marriages with everybody that I have it with. Let's just check here. We've got it with France. Yeah, we want France back. Absolutely. That won't happen for a long time, though, because we're already at 100 improved relations. Yeah. Now, one of the cool things that I can do with this expansion pack is actually support an independence. So let's say... Uh... Let's say Cologne was a vassal of Munster. I can support the independence here in Westphalen, or in Cologne, whatever. And if they decide they want to become independent from their... their overlord Munster, then I would help them do that in their their war for independence. That's basically what that does. Um, so that's actually a really, really cool feature. I like that a lot. Alright, we should probably get the time going here. I don't know exactly... What happened? What the hell is this? Incorporate Scotland into... Why did we lose... What? We have failed to complete a mission. Well, I don't know why that wasn't... Okay, either way, we have, um, found an East American colony. That's perfect. Yes, we are going to do that because we're gonna have that stuff. Uh, we're gonna have all of those lands. Uh, yeah, I don't know why I failed to incorporate Scotland. Maybe it just was on a time limit? I don't know. Um, but we are out of, uh, diplomats right now, so we can't really do much besides colonize, so it's good time to let us focus on that. So after we're done with this colony, we're gonna go right on over to, um, hopefully... Maine, or, yeah, Maine's considered a 13 colony, yeah? Uh, no, I want, uh, region. Where is that? That would be right there. Yeah, that's 13 colony. Okay. All oh, this blue area. So this colony is at 210. It's gonna take a little while. The problem is, we need another colonist. Uh, they're threatening our trade. Are you now, England? Really? Alright, well, I might, well, I can't actually, um... Uh, embargo you because I don't have any diplomats. Damn it. Uh. Well, one thing that I think I'm going to do once I get a diplomat back, besides... Oh! We are the, uh, the papal controller. Look at that. Uh, one thing that I am going to do once I get it back is, um... Go to war against England. I think it's time to go to war again. I mean, we just got out of our peasants' war, but I think, I really think we need to, um... Go to war with England again. Okay, so this guy is going to come all the way down here to Schleswig. And then we're going to grab our boats. A nice 52 stack of boats, which is absolutely crazy. 
and head on over to Schleswig as well. We're going to drop them off. Well, no, they can sit there for a while. I want to drop them off on England eventually, but right now we don't have to do that. We also have to build up our second half of our army because, uh, well, it got destroyed. In fact, we actually can destroy two boats, so we might as well. Alrighty, let's see. We'll get rid of some galleys. We'll get rid of the U, because I can't pronounce you, and... Hmm. I guess you too. Yes. Alright. Destroy. Good. Go to Slesvig. Alright, so we still have our explorer fleet, who actually has an explorer, so we might as well let him do his job. And send him down here. Did we discover Bermuda? Yes, we did. Alright, let's go explore uh, the rest of Florida. Alright, keep going. In here. And then all the way back up to Arcadia. Okay. We're going to be producing fur in um, Ubanek. Uh, no, Ubamakik. Sorry. Okay, we just discovered a lot of land down here. Now, I would love to actually come down here and grab Florida. But um, it might not... It might be taken at that point. What I think I'm going to do from now on, I do want to settle up here in Canada, but I am going to kind of go down the coast now and just block this off from uh, Castile and Portugal. Because I know that they are down here in South America, which does not mean that they're going to grab anything up here yet, but hey, they're pretty damn close. So I want to grab as much as I can of North America as soon as possible, and maybe even, you know, an island or two down here. We can invest in a technology. Hmm. Or an idea, rather. I don't think we need the extra missionary at this point. I think I want to... Yeah. Let's um. Let's just go for administrative technology. Unless it's... Oh, it's three years of... Well, no, that's actually right. Yeah, we're going to focus on the technology right now. And I really need this other... Um, this other colonist. But we need the tech first. So we can extend our colonial range. I also want to finish up New Finland over here. Grab Beothuk, but I, I don't... Or Beothuk, I don't know how you pronounce it. But I won't really focus on that right now. It's not a priority. Uh, declared war on Hesse. Alright, you have fun Central Europe. I don't care. Oh my god, look at Burgundy. They are still really, really big. That is crazy. That is absolutely crazy. And Venice. Venice is the most surprising because they took... They took out the freaking Ottomans. That's just nuts. Uh, oh, what do we have here? Yeah, I know that Embrace the Counter-Reformation. I don't think we're going to do that until we absolutely need it. But I don't I don't know if Protestantism will actually be able to hit us. I mean, it hasn't yet. Uh, declare that. Um, no. No, I don't want that. Nowhere do I want that at this point in time. We have 19, 3, and 2. Right. Yes. Very bad. So we want to grab at least one more of them. Okay, so we'll have at least 20, uh, 20 infantry. Then we're going to want at least 10 cavalry. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then at least 5 cannons. So we're going to get 3 of them. 1, 2, 3. Alright, we'll see where we are at the end of that. Oh, wow, we just don't gain enough each month. We need to start working on... See, I don't know what it is, because armories, I don't think that helps with reinforcement speed, does it? It might. I mean, what is this um, This local recruitment time? Minus 5%. I think that's the time it takes to actually build the unit, not uh, reinforcement speed. We can get a march. That helps. I mean, it increases our manpower, but... I mean, manpower is always good. Oh, influenza virus. Ew, gross. All right, let's quarantine the port of Skane, or Skane, or Skane. One of them. Yeah, do it. Getting armories is not going to be a bad idea anyways, because we want more manpower eventually. So let's do this. Good. Uh, where else? Oh, in the new world. I don't think it's going to be worth it. Actually, we can't even do it here yet. Where's... We're missing it. Ah, Okay. Bornholm? Oops. Hang on. One second. Bornholm and the Shetland. No. Orkney? Yes, Orkney. Shetlands are right there. 
Okay. Uh, so we convert. Oh, we converted. Yes. All right. Good. So that means that we are at a hundred percent religious unity. No more. What is it? Uh, Orthodox. Yes. Good. Uh, I don't think Sami is going to be good for us. Sami doesn't have a lot of base text, as you can see right here. This is Sami. It's only got one, 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 and one. So it'll never be. Or, well, that's the same thing. Yeah. So a total of four. No, a total of three tags in the Sami um, culture, which is not going to be beneficial at all. So, it'll never be accepted, therefore it'll never produce, an, you know, the amount of money it would. See, it's only producing 0.19 because it's not the accepted culture. So, I think we'll just convert these. Yep, let's convert them. Uh, actually, no, we want our Diplotech first. Same with Corellian, that's not gonna be worthwhile. Finish might be, well, I don't even think Finish will. Oh, God. What is this right here? Finish. Finish. Well, I really, I, yeah, finish won't be either. That's crazy. We, the problem with all of this region up here is that it's not worth it for, you know, provinces. They're not good provinces. They really suck. So what we really have to do is go deeper into Europe. Or at least come over here to Lithuania. Lithuania's got some good provinces up in the north. Well... Kind of. There's a th couple of sevens thrown in there that I want to take out, so I guess going East Europe would be better. Let's go to our Explorer fleet and explore some more. I wish there was an auto-explore button, but that's okay. Let's just freaking explore Massachusetts. This is bucking me to all hell. <laughs> just get it out of the way. I want to see it. Oh, did they cut Massachusetts in half? Yeah, look at that. There's actually two of them now. Interesting. I don't think it was like that before. Uh, what just happened? Oh, right, Cardinal. We want to keep on focusing on this, considering we are the Papal Controller now. So, what do we have? 27? Ugh, we can't get anything. We'll work on Drewers. Yeah. Alright. Portugal is still disputed secession. I don't think I'm going to claim the throne, though. I don't think it's going to be worth it. All right, we're at 4-4. Four, four. Oh, no, our statesman died. Damn it. Uh, well, we'll have to get another one, so... Yeah, do it. Let's get a level 2 guy. The statesman helps a lot with uh, annexing, I think. These aren't... Oh, God, when are these going to be done? 49 is the most. That's eh, not that bad, but having no diplomatic... Having no um, diplomats really, really sucks. I'm kind of at... Oh, my God, I like this music. Must be part of the new music that I, uh, from the new pack. It's really, really nice. Alright, let's sit in Shayland, because we can't support it there in Slushbrig. Ah, priests are preaching heresy. Really? Well, that's not good. Um, crack down on it. Holy crap, we're only getting plus two from diplomatic power? Okay, who can we drop? Uh-huh. <laughs> The problem is when we, uh, release a lot of vassals. That's the real issue here. France. Mm, yeah, let's drop France. We are the Curia controller, so we can lose it without, uh, taking a, um, a stability hit. So let's break world ties. I'm sorry. Sorry, France. But I can't afford you. <laughs> Alright, now we're making plus three at least. And then hopefully these will finish in a reasonable amount of time so that we can get more diplomatic power. Actually, once these three finish, we're going to be golden. Bible translated. Okay, what is this? A priest in Marston has translated the Bible into our language. Perfect. Uh, and has started to distribute the copies of it to nearby villages throughout uh, Bohuslan, wherever that may be. Okay. Um, heresy. Oh, God. No, that's... Ooh. That's a lot of points there. Hmm. Oh, the religion... In Bohuslan changes to Protestant. Really? Well, no, we'll call it heresy for now. In fact, I think I might want to just keep... Catholicism. I'm not sure, though. We'll see. We'll definitely see. It depends on what happens when the Protestant movement really takes off. Uh, I, actually, it has, really. Yeah. Well, we'll see. I mean, it's still in its growing phase, and it really hasn't touched us, surprisingly enough. So... We might be good, who knows? I mean, getting the religious ideas isn't that bad. Oh! 
We just gained a bunch of cores in the new world. Yeah, gaining the um, the re the religious ideas isn't that bad, considering if I want to expand into Muscovy, um, that's all orthodox. That's all orthodox. Even down here, all orthodox. So getting religious ideas is going to help me get rid of that, considering I want to expand into Eastern Europe. Um, that's not that bad of a idea group to grab. Okay, so our cannons are coming into place here. Let's just put you guys together. Good. All right, so now we have a fully... Oh, wait, no, we're missing one. There he is. Okay, so we have 12, 13, and 5. For some reason, I didn't do the math right on the uh, the cavalry. I don't know why. <laughs> um, well, let's see. We can grab 16 more troops. All right, well, 10 of them is going to be... Infantry. One, two, three, four. Oh, we don't have enough manpower. All right, don't do that then. Let's just wait it out then. Just wait till our manpower increases a little bit more, and then we'll be good. All right, explore. Yes, we finally explored. We have Massachusetts. Good. Let's go visit the Mayans. And then come over here. Come back this way, and then up to Acadia again. Thank you very much. Okay, we're almost, we're halfway done with this colony, and then we'll go over to Massachusetts immediately. Grab a 13 colony in the, uh, the landing spot of the 13 colonies. Might as well, right? Where's negative six? Oh, hang on. Is this killing us here? No, I don't see manpower recovery speed in there. I'm trying to think of what it was. What was our manpower recovery anyways? Like, what was the reinforcement speed? Because I don't remember... If it was good or not. Ah, okay. Oh, it looks like England left the military coalition. Bad move. And really, there's not much I can really do at this point in time. I'm... Uh, well, actually, we are gaining some more um, manpower, so let's go ahead and build up some more of an army. Alright, so let's see. We are at, uh, like I said, 16. So we can grab 16 guys. We're gonna grab at least 10 more infantry. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Ten more infantry. Good. And then we'll wait. Now, the plan is to split this after I'm done with it. In fact, I can actually split this right now, considering considering it's not actually um, supported here. Uh, yes. Give me technology 12. Okay. Fantastic. So that allows administrative monarchy, which we are actually going to grab. Right now we have feudal monarchy, which is a 10% increase for income from vassals. Actually, you know what? While we have these vassals, I'm actually going to keep this. Yeah. Uh, and 10% to national manpower modified, but that doesn't really matter. I don't mind that going away. Um, the uh, administrative monarchy has 10% production efficiency and 10% or 5% national... Actually, you know what? I think it might just be good to keep Feudal Monarchy for a while. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there it is. Look at it. If we go to Constitutional Monarchy, 10% recovery speed. Of course, that's when we grab... It's 22. Yeah, that's going to be a long time anyways. Alright, so let's just split these guys in half. You can go there. Alright, not bad. Now we just have to pretty much... Even out the uh, the groups here. We have about six left, <laughs> which isn't that much, but eventually we'll be able to even these out to create um, identical armies. The quartermaster has died. Oh no. Do we have any recovery speed in here? No, I don't even know if there is one. Oh crap, it's a level two. Oh, uh, we can't support you. Well, I mean, we can, but I want to gain. Well, we. Can... Hmm. Yeah, alright, let's do um, land maintenance modifier. Decrease our costs. Peasants getting uppity. Well, we don't want peasants to get uppity, so um, I guess we'll lose some administrative power. Yes, that sounds fantastic. Uh, I guess what we could do is actually go and attack Riga. Right? No, we have to fabricate a claim anyways, right? Uh, wait a minute. Oh, we gained a diplomat. Alright, well, England, you are now being embargoed, so there. <laughs> and then we'll uh, we'll fabricate a claim on Riga while we still have this this papacy. We should probably uh, actually give us some more cardinals. There we go. All right. 
It's only one cardinal, but it's fine. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, look at that. Una Makik has been um, fully... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> send it to Massachusetts, and we'll just send you down there. Luckily, it's connected by, um, well, land, so uh, we're going to be good. Oh, okay. Um, looks like trade dispute... Oh, what? Lithuania? What are you doing? All right. Well, we'll just embargo you. Two can play that game. And looks like the Emperor has enacted Imperial Reform. That's not good. Where are we? With oh, wrong one. Where are we? Ah. Uh, well, I mean, right now, we don't have to really get worried. Uh, when they revoke the Privilegia, then we do. Then we really do. Because all members are actually going to become vassals of the Emperor, which is not going to be good. So we want to kind of make sure that we're at least into Central Europe at that point.